Hello everyone, this is Pakshita Fashion Workshop. I remind you that we post new videos every day. Today I'm going to give you a review of all dresses in my wardrobe. These are all of them. I decided to shoot this video because I got tired of people asking me if I have the rooms full of clothes. I don't. I am being honest. These are all the dresses I have for all seasons, including the vacation dresses, including the dresses which time is long gone. This one, for example. The color has already faded, but I can't help myself. I love it. It's very comfortable. There is one more dress which shouldn't be worn anymore, but I love it. This is my shirt dress. You've already seen me wearing it. People think that I have a lot of different clothes. It's not true. There is one thing I want to tell you. I get tired of clothes. As soon as I realize that I don't need or that I don't like a garment, I get rid of it. I either give it to someone or throw it away. This is why I make the mock-ups. I don't need to sew the garments which I don't like. It's not enough to sew clothes. They should be taken care of. I should always keep in my mind where the needed clothes are. Some are at home, some in the studio, some in the dry cleaners. There is one more important thing. There are 26 dresses here. I'm going to show you each of these dresses. These are the evening dresses. I have just a couple of them. I don't need more. It's not that I have many different occasions to wear such dresses for. I don't sew the evening dresses in advance. If I need a dress for a special occasion, I'll sew a new one for it. If I go to a restaurant or to a theater, I'll just put on some of these. A couple of chiffon dresses, a couple of cocktail dresses, a couple of linen dresses, and a couple of vacation dresses. Guys, I want you to understand one thing. If you sew a new dress every two weeks, in a year you will have the same number of dresses as I do. There is one more thing I want to tell you. Three of these dresses were bought. This is the first one. You've already seen it. I've even showed you how to make it. Watch the videos if you haven't done it yet. To be honest, I even like the dress which I made better. I am thinking of making this dress in other colors. I'm not sure about it yet. This dress was also bought in a shop. My daughter bought it in Rome for me. This is a twin set, heavily here. I attached the net to the bottom. It looks as if the dress was put on top of the shirt. I attached the net because I didn't feel comfortable in this dress without it. I like such twin set dresses. The net doesn't make the dress look any worse. I'm not going to buy any more twin set dresses, because I already have this one. I've already showed you these two dresses. Have a look at this one. This dress is of American designer Tadashi Shoji. This is an evening dress. I haven't showed it to you yet. I have a beautiful set of matching earrings for this dress. I'm going to show you a review of this dress in one of the next videos. I know that it looks pretty unusual this way. The dress is close fitting. There is a slit on the front. The draping makes the dress fit me perfectly. As I've already said, these are the only three dresses among all of them, which were bought, not made. Let's have a look at the winter dresses. This one is very warm. This is a woolen dress. I've already showed you this cape. 
Do you remember the video from the boutique in Paris? I wear this cape with different dresses and outfits. I've put it on top of this dress, because the dress was made specially for it. As I've already said, the dress is very warm. I usually wear it with the light coats or even raincoats where it's still pretty chilly outside. I don't wear it with the warm coats, because it's made of the strong wool. This is my favorite dress. It's also made of wool. The wool is of a very high quality. The fabric is very light and it's soft to the touch. Notice that it's even seen through. This dress is also pretty warm. This is my multifunctional dress with a jacket attached to it. Watch the videos on how to make it if you haven't done it yet. I don't wear it often, because it's also pretty warm. I remind you that I made the detachable collars for this dress. I also have matching blouses. The dress looks good both with the jacket and without it. This is the only dress I have in which the jacket can be attached to the dress. I showed you its making very thoroughly, so watch the videos if you haven't done it yet. I don't wear it often. It's always warm in the studio, so there is no need for me to wear the warm clothes on the everyday basis. Do you remember my jacket dress? I love it. It's also pretty warm. I don't wear it often, even though the dress is pretty comfortable. I'm not going to give this dress to anyone or throw it away. I actually do like it. It's just that I really don't get a chance to wear it. These were my winter dresses, except for this one. It's also suitable for spring and autumn. You've already seen me wearing this dress a lot of times. I could hang all dresses on one rack. There was enough space for it. I just didn't want to do it. Let's have a look at the evening dresses. This is a dress of an American designer. I'm going to get back to it later. This is my favorite Lanvin style dress. I've already showed it to you. I gave you its full review and told you about the making. Watch the video about it, if you haven't done it yet. I showed you how to cut such dresses very thoroughly. To be honest, this dress is not that convenient. I love it, I do. But it's not always convenient to put 6 meters of fabric on you. You need to think about the circumstances in advance. Oh, this is my favorite thing in the world, the jumpsuit. I know that it's not a dress, but I decided that it should be placed here among them. I've already showed it to you when we were talking about the jumpsuits. I remind you that there is an elastic in the back waistband. Let's have a look at the next one. I remind you that we are talking about the evening dresses. I love this one, it's very beautiful. I have a pair of matching high heels. The top layer of the dress is made of the net. It's decorated with the flowers. This is a gathered half circle skirt. The lower skirt is also half circle. The bottom of the dress is edged with the white facing. There are the drop shoulders and the princess seams in the upper part of the dress. I love it. When I made the dress, I decided that I needed to buy a gold colored belt for it. I did. When I put it on and looked in the mirror, I said to myself, you need to make your waist tighter first. This is why I wear this dress without the belt. It's very beautiful, but I don't wear it often. I'm shooting this video for you to stop thinking that I have several rooms full of clothes. It's not true. This really is my favorite dress in the whole world. This is the best design ever. Dolman sleeves and the side details instead of the side seams. I took this dress to my Paris trip. I love it. It looks good with different shoes, boots, 
The dress was made of the cotton fabric of the very high quality. When the color started fading, I decided to wash the dress with an addition of the special wash powder for the black garments. It looks even worse now. It was more black before it was washed. I do know that it's time for this dress to make its bow, but I'm not ready to say goodbye to it. I love it. This is the dress made on the basis of the Japanese sewing techniques. I've also showed you the making of it. Watch the videos if you haven't done it yet. This is not really an evening dress, but it's not a casual dress neither. It is made of the high-quality jersey fabric. I love it. I'm sure that it will be in my wardrobe for a long time. Have a look at the next dress. I'm going to make a course on how to sew it. I have a matching bag and a pair of matching shoes. The dress is made of the high-quality jacket fabric. I wear this dress pretty often because it's very comfortable. It's of a very interesting design. I'm sure that many of you will make such dresses after buying the video course. You've already seen most of the dresses which are shown here. I think that the dress of the American designer is the only new one for you. This dress is very beautiful. I love it. Next comes my origami dress. The one with the draping on the front. I love it. This is a cocktail dress. I put the my chiffon cape on top of it. I wear this cape not only on top of this dress, but also with some other garments. Have a look at its back. It's gathered here at the top. The gathers were steamed, so they look very beautiful. I haven't showed you a review of this cape. As I've already said, I wear it not only with this dress, but with different ones. That's all for today. I really hope that you like this video. Next time we'll continue looking at my dresses. You can find the links for the tutorials for the shown dresses in the description of the video. My name is Pauk Shterina. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Goodbye.